Okay students, let us understand how to set line spacing. Line spacing is the vertical distance between successive lines of the text in a document. We can also increase or decrease the line spacing between a paragraph. Select the text. Click on the line and paragraph spacing button in the paragraph group on the home tab. Select the desired option of line spacing from the drop down list or to set more precise spacing measurements, click on the paragraph dialog box launcher. The paragraph dialog box appears. Select the indent and spacing tab and then select the required line spacing option under the spacing section. Click on OK button and notice the change. Students, note that we can press Shift plus Enter to insert blank lines in the bulleted or numbered list. Let me share a tip with you. Microsoft Word 2010 provides a quick styles gallery which offers a variety of ready-made styles that a user can apply to the selected text. A user can also define the style as per his requirements. Quick styles are available in the styles group and on the home tab. The default line spacing for most quick style sets is 1.15. Students, let me tell you that how to set paragraph spacing. Paragraph spacing is the amount of space above or below paragraph. Follow the steps to set the paragraph spacing. Select the paragraph before or after which you want to change the spacing. Click on the paragraph dialog box launcher button on the home tab in the font group. The paragraph dialog box will open. By default, the indents and spacing tab is opened. Enter or set the required spacing in the before and after spin boxes under the spacing section. Click OK. All right, students. Now let us learn how to create bulleted and numbered list. We can format list in a document by using bullets and numbers. A bullet is a small graphic symbol that sets off an item in a list. To apply bullets to the text, follow these steps. Select the text and click on the bullets button in the paragraph group on the home tab. Select the bullet style of your choice. You will find that the selected text is bulleted and the indents are automatically adjusted to separate the text from the bullets. Similarly, you can apply numbered list to the text. Students, note that to apply numbering effects on the text, select on the numbering button in the paragraph group and select the list style of your choice.